Hey Blue Table fans, got an extra special treat for you today. These are two models that have been highly converted and uh, this is a case where the client is doing his own painting and we only did the conversion work. So um, th this model is actually pretty complex. I, I don't know entirely how it goes together, So, but he's got this uh, pretty ornate banner. The client had some pretty specific requests about, you know, a necrons and other types of uh, heads or races that would be uh, there. He also requested uh, towel parts. So as you can see, we've got this uh, piece there. And um, so this is a power claw that goes on. It actually has sort of a bracket shape to it. And uh, I do believe uh, this goes thumb down like that. Uh, but it can be reversed. You can put the little uh, slicer thing on top uh, if that's desired. So can you imagine that? A power claw with like giant, you know, tree cutting uh, chainsaws on it. So you have this giant weapon with like loads of DACA on it. And um, so let's see here. Also, we have a hammer. And uh, this is an example of how our extensive BTP bits wall uh, really can make something into something special. So this claw is actually, this mechanical claw is actually from the uh, War Machine range. So you get it on there and uh, it has, it has a, a kind of a really nice form to it, I think, uh, with the um, War Boss kind of looking that direction. So anyway, I like it. So that's, uh, that's a giant hammer. And then, of course, we have a, a burst cannon, and that, um, uh, yeah, that fits under there. There's actually a couple magnets under there. So, um, anyway, so it's got a lot of different pieces to it. And um, I'm not going to, well, I may as well show all of them. We have uh, this thing here, um, sort of a, a Necron Tesla weapon, a flamer. And uh, so the, I believe these are all for like combi weapons, so, and a rocket. Okay, so uh, let's look at the next thing. So this is very disparate. Um, the next uh, thing is a 40K Demon Prince, and you've actually seen this unprimed. And quite frankly, I don't know how this video is gonna turn out. Uh, so you have a lot of different pieces. Uh, many of the, it's based on a Warhammer Giant kit. Uh, again, we've, we've shown this uh, before. Uh, Blight Drone Carapace and Wings. It's got pieces from the new uh, Magoth Lord kits on there. So uh, definitely a lot of green stuff. And um, the, uh, the tongue that comes out of his arm, which by the way, I think this arm is just great. Uh, that's a breakaway. So it doesn't have another piece that goes on it. It's just there for, for storage and so that it doesn't break off. Um, these things dangling here, this, this is really, that, that's, that's really great. It's a challenge to paint. Um, and in fact, you can just uh, kind of slide some glue on there and it will, it will stiffen those. But quite frankly, I think this looks good. This is uh, from a War Machine piece, one of the, um, oh, I can't, I cannot remember the name for that. But anyway, it's from the, uh, the new Cephalix guys. So, all right. Well, uh, that's two unusual pieces. And um, at BTP, we have tons of bits uh, and we just... It's a part-time job just to clip them and sort them, and, uh, but it is a huge benefit if you have your work done here uh, because we, we don't charge for the bits unless they're unusual somehow, and uh, so it becomes this great resource for clients. Well, thanks for tuning in, and I hope you got your inspiration for the day.